Thank you to Regent Mendoza, Provost Short, and Cameron for your remarks. My name is Khadija Kone. I'm a member of the MLK Planning Committee, a resident assistant at Cooper Village One, and the Vice President of Zeta Phi Beta Sorority Incorporated, the Phi Epsilon Chapter. I have this distinct pleasure of introducing our speaker, Ms. Nikki Giovanni. Nikki Giovanni is a world-renowned poet, writer, commentator, activist, and educator. Over the past 30 years, her outspokenness in her writing and in lectures has brought the eyes of the world upon her. One of the most widely read American poets, she prides herself on being a black woman, a daughter, a mother, and a professor of English. Giovanni remains as determined and as committed as ever to fight for civil rights and equality. Always insisting, insisting on presenting the truth as she sees it, she has maintained a prominent place as a strong voice for the black community. Her focus is on the individually, specifically on the power one has to make the difference in oneself, and thus in the lives of others. Nikki Giovanni was born in Knoxville, Tennessee, and grew up in Lincoln Heights, an all-black suburb of Cincinnati, Ohio. She and her sisters spent her their summers with their grandparents in Knoxville, and she graduated with honors from Fisk University. Her grandpa was on the modern in 1968. After graduating from Fisk, she attended the University of Pennsylvania and Columbia University. She published her first book of poetry, Black Feeling, Black Talk, in 1968, and within the next year published a second book, thus launching her career as a writer. Early in her career, she was dubbed the Princess of Black Poetry. And over the course of more than three decades of publishing and lecturing, she has come to be called both a national treasure and most recently one of Oprah Winfrey's 25 living legends. Many of Giovanni's books have received honors and awards. Her autobiography, Gemini, was a finalist for the National Book Award. Love poems, blues for all the changes, and quilting the Black Eyed Pea were all honored before the NAACP Image Awards. Blues for All the Changes reached number four on the Los Angeles Times bestseller list, a rare achievement for a book of poems. Most recently, her children's picture book, Rosa, about the civil rights legend Rosa Parks, became a Caldecott honor book, and Brian Collier, the illustrator, was given the Coretta Scott King Award for Best Illustration. Rosa also reached number three on the New York Times bestseller list. She's an honorary member of Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated, and she has received a life membership and scroll from the National Council of Negro Women. A member of PN, she was honored for her life and career by the history makers. She has received the keys to more than two dozen cities. The author of some 30 books for both adults and children, Nikki Giovanni is a university distinguished professor at Virginia Tech in Blacksburg, Virginia, and is the recipient of Virginia Tech's highest honor, the Alumni Outreach Award. Please help me welcome Nikki Giovanni to the stage.